Okay, so tonight I'm going to make a few pumpkins and I'm going to use this, um, I'm not sure what it is, from Dollar Tree. I'm sure you've seen these. They're a toy and you put them on your wrist. And Then I also ran across these two small slinky type toys. And I grabbed those today actually and thought I would make two small ones as well. Now I originally saw this on Cuban Curls and I will link her video below because I want to give her credit for the inspiration that she gave me to do these. And here you'll see that I am going to use some glue to hold the two small ones together. Now the big one, all you had to do is open it up and it stays. And I did go outside and spray paint the big one white. And once I get these together, I'm going to spray paint these black. And then I'll add stems and a few little things to it, and you'll see, so I'll just let you watch. Okay, so now they're all spray painted. I'm just using some floral wire to make those little curls that you see on the pumpkins. And then I am using just some sticks out of the yard for the stems. And I'm going to go out and spray paint these gold. And really it's just to seal the wood stems that I'm using. And then I'm gonna come back in and give them a coat of this burnt umber and I'm gonna wipe it off a little bit. It does not need to be perfect, just to give it the look of wood. But I did use that gold spray paint. Since it is wood from outdoors, I just wanted to put something on it to seal it. And I'm using these leaves off of some florals that I had on hand. And I'm just going to glue those on, glue the little wood stems on, and the little curls. And then I'm going to go in with some tags that I picked up at Walmart. And here are those little tags. I actually got these for 25 cents on clearance. And I'm going to paint one with the burnt umber and the two smaller ones. I'm going to use the moss green chalk paint. And then I'm going to use some of those Dollar Tree stickers, the leaves, and just put on there. Uh, they do stick, but I did go in with some hot glue because they fell off. And I'm going to write one, two, and three on those and on the big pumpkin, I will use some raffia to tie it on, but on the smaller ones, I just used a little hot glue and put it on the front of the pumpkin because I was having trouble tying the raffia around the stem on the smaller ones. So that's my little twist on these.
here now I will display these for you okay so here they are I think they turned out really adorable I would like to put a little raffia on those smaller ones and maybe some more on the bigger one I may just need to take it and go in and hot glue it on there instead of trying to tie it around but I hope you guys enjoyed the video tonight and be sure to check out Cuban Curls. Like I said, I did get my original inspiration from her. And I will leave her video link below in the description box. Thank you guys so much for watching tonight. Thanks to my subscribers for your continued support. And if you're not a subscriber, I'd love to have you join. Just hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to be notified of upcoming videos. Like, share, and comment, and I will see you in my next video.